The inaugural ceremony of the 32nd ASEAN Ministers on Energy Meeting, or AMEM, convened on Tuesday, the 23rd of September in Vientiane, the capital of the Lao PDR, where Laos we push for the accelerations of energy integration under the ASEAN Power Grid, or APG, to address the imbalance in the distribution of the power, generating resources in the region. The inaugural ceremony of the 32nd ASEAN Ministers on Energy Meeting, or AMEM, was addressed by Lao Minister of Energy and Mines, Suliwong Dalawong, before the welcome speech by Lao Prime Minister Tong Sing Thamavong. Uh, Minister of the ASEAN Member States, ASEAN Secretariat, Distinguished Ambassadors, Dialogue Partner and Development Partner, Distinguished Colleagues and Guests, Ladies and Gentlemen, First of all, allow me to express my deepest warm welcome to all of you. The Lao Minister of Energy and Mines said the Lao PDR has the honor of hosting this important event for the second time since Laos officially joined ASEAN in July 1997. The first time Laos hosted AMEM was the 24th meeting in July 2006 under the theme Power Integration for ASEAN Prosperity. He said he strongly believed that Laos will be able to make a greater contribution towards developing cooperation and exchanging experiences to get more mutual benefits from interlocking relationships. The environment for social economic development of the country has been created and with that it's possible According to Lao Minister of Energy and Mines, Suliwong Dalawong, ASEAN is one of the fastest growing economic regions with a rapid arising energy demand. To meet its growing demand for energy, particularly for sustainable power utilization, we need to think about modalities that will connect all member countries' national grids to become a regional grid, or the so-called ASEAN Power Grid. Therefore, with abundant renewable energy resources in the ASEAN region, particularly in hydropower potential, we will have vast opportunities to efficiently utilize ASEAN's available energy resources. <laughs> In his opening remark, Lao Prime Minister Tong Sing Tamavong stated that the government of the Lao PDR has always attached great importance to environmental protection and sustainable development, particularly in respects of the abundance of ecosystem and biodiversity. At the same time, our policy on natural resources calls for La PDR to address the great potential for hydropower development of hydropower generates about one-third of La PDR's capital income from natural resources. The Lao Premier also said adding that we, the ASEAN countries, should enhance cooperation and increase the exchange of knowledge on energy development Therefore, in this 32nd AMEM and related meetings, Prime Minister Tong Sing urged the ASEAN countries to work together to firstly clearly define a legal and policy framework related to the promotion of renewable energy into a sustainable development strategy. Secondly, to strengthen research and development on renewable energy technology appropriate to the ASEAN region. Thirdly, to continue studies on the renewable energy market and provide necessary funding for the promotion of environmentally friendly green energy. And fourthly, to encourage high voltage power integration aiming at energy exchange from each energy resource, effectively starting from small scale to large scale. Along the way, can identify measures to overcome the difficulties and challenges.